just got in, in, in Portsmouth, like a tunnel way when you leave Dover. Yeah, I'm gonna land down. 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 I'm Hey guys, how are you? Hope you guys are good. Welcome back or welcome. <laughs> um, I'll explain everything since the Gop Ailey. We're just quickly stopping for a quick pit stop and then yeah. See y'all. Hi guys, welcome. <laughs> Hey guys, actually, let me do my intro, Clary. Hey guys, welcome. Oh no, you guys are making me shy. We're live, baby. What do you do? What do you do? We're live, baby. YouTube channel, we do it. We're live, baby. I'm gonna hate that joke. You know, it's always been a dream of mine, actually. Really? Yeah, to start a YouTube channel. So why don't you do it? Why don't you do it? And do it and lie to them. You lie to niggas, dog. Tell them like all sorts of lies. Tell your friends you f right, no, man. No. We don't swear on this so channel, okay, guys. What, what do you call your subscribers? Okay, wait, 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 wait. Um, my dolls. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I'm sorry for swearing. I didn't don't mean worry, it. Don't worry, I'll mute it out, guys. We don't swear on this channel. I'm sorry. Tell you what, John, should I get the intro? Tell your people. Come on, me, me. Hi. I see more cooking, make Jimo. Hi, Charlie. You must be longer than me, me. Okay. Show this nigga. This nigga has to be seen. Jimela. Say hi. <laughs> Say hi, bro. Speak Jimela. English. Speak English. Jimela and Lekai. Who's gonna watch tech, by the way? Ha ha. Hey. Yeah, you watch tech. As for so many details. Yeah, As for to... you. This guy's from Poch Who the hell goes Poch to Poch Tech? He went to Poch Tech, this nigga. So many years later and you can't get over it. I can't. Who the hell goes to Poch Tech, bro? Ew. <laughs> Alright, my dolls. So there's a takeover today. But don't get inside intro. Here we go. Hi Turlies, welcome back to the YouTube channel. What do you do? What do you do? What do you do? Don't forget to click that subscribe button. Yes. And call your friends and tell them to subscribe. Do you know what? Do you know what I would do now? I would take my sister's YouTube <laughs> account and subscribe to my favorite channel. You understand what I'm saying? That's how you show support. Do the same. Thank do the you. same. Subscribe. Guys. We want those what they subscriptions, said. man. Please. So you guys have been asking us in our DMs. <laughs> <laughs> In Poch, have you seen? I definitely, definitely <laughs> I haven't been here in so long, it feels so weird. Now I'm back, I'm suddenly back in Poch and I'm a YouTuber. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're so tall, bruh, guys. I'm so short. The so heels, I'm wearing heels. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> what do you mean? That's safe. Something might happen to England, but. Oh yes, yes, actually, you're right. And I don't see what we're looking for. Wait, so bad, like, I don't think they come. A cake cake. Yes. Oh, okay. Guys, it's actually Tabiso's birthday. He shares a birthday. Yes, old hey, Jordan year. Happy birthday. Jordan year, guys, he shares a birthday with my mom. Happy birthday, mommy, when you see this. Happy birthday. <laughs> I know she's gonna say happy birthday to you, too. <laughs> so, we're looking for a cake now for Tabby. Sorry, so we're looking for a cake for him. Um, I'm kind of running. Oh, okay, it's a kid. Oh, you don't want this one. What type of cake are you looking for? It must be for a lot of people, I think. How much is it? Like, how many? I don't know. Marvis? Isn't this one a bit bigger than the round one? 
Or what, what did you have in mind? Set up a box so you can get two. Oh, yes, yes. Uh, Let me help you with the other one. <laughs> Better not <laughs> drop it. But this one looks like it's a good for Yeah. Or would yeah. it be weird for you to cut the slices in half?
Okay, here I am, guys. I changed my favorite wig. You already know. <laughs> the lost child. Everything's all set up. There's my family there. Yeah. This is my mom and my aunt. This is my drink. Let's say so. When I look back, look at what it is. This is already mentioned for one of our no doubt about it. It's about patience. But what I'm feeling is not enough. I think I'm just like that. Now, for the last 18 months, can you tell me we've been going through hell? Can you tell me what happened? Can you tell me what happened? As a mother, make us a corner for a while. Make me want to open the open and get out of the bush. But you made it a point for the local tavern. Would you want to suffer? I for no kill it, some of it is a lady petrol. So we are coming with a force. Yes, blessing the army, but we go as in an Who in a rise on boost? Yeah, we give thanks that we need it the most. Yeah, we give thanks that we're really supposed to be thankful. Yes. 
subscribe guys subscribe <laughs> For you to come to me I'm holding on No matter what the story reads The binding has been done <laughs> Jeez man, I'm, I'm so tired <laughs> I'm so tired guys um, <laughs> so I'm so sorry I haven't been able to talk to you guys since like today like it's just I know I always say my vlogs are all over the place but this one is really all over the place it's been a busy day guys like I am home as you can see <laughs> I'm home currently uh, I left Jules back today and I'm going back tomorrow um literally just came through to celebrate my mom's birthday and mother's day with her but funny enough actually the intention wasn't to come this weekend um my mom had like a month ago thought that she would host like a young lunch dinner just intimate vibes then jiki jiki she changed then jiki jiki days days before she decided actually i'm gonna do this thing so the invite was sort of last minute um but because i had already known about it i guess you could say i was like you know what i have to come through especially because my brothers now couldn't pull through so i knew i had to hold the fork <laughs> that's just the thing with being the only daughter okay being the only girl and like my, i couldn't expect my mom to do things by herself and i just had to come and witness this moment guys it's not like i was doing anything today in any case so whether it was last minute or not i just had to show up like while i still have a chance guys <laughs> there will be opportunities in my life where it's like i can't just have the luxury of coming home and studies like that whenever i want to so while i still can let me pull through um it was really just a beautiful day it didn't start off that way though <laughs> it started off a little bit rough i was just so irritated guys i even burned my dress <laughs> i love God. this dress to pieces and i actually think it's the most inexpensive dress that i have but i love this dress so much guys i don't know what it is about it but it just gives me so much confidence like doesn't matter what day i'm wearing it i just feel like that girl like i just feel like also from Peang, you know <laughs> although i wear dresses most of the time but i want to show y'all guys and for me because i love this dress so much i feel like burnt or not i'm gonna continue wearing this dress luckily it's just at the bottom <sighs> guys so the minute the minute i pulled the iron it burned my dress y'all guys the way i was even in such a hurry i didn't even have time <laughs> to have a moment about it i literally burnt it finished ironing and had to put it on and just get in get on the road so i'm really sad about this but i continued wearing it no one noticed <laughs> just my one friend though noticed but he noticed because he was closing my door other than that guys if you see me in person and i'm wearing this dress and it's burnt don't ask me anything in any case guys um other than this morning just starting off on a very irritating annoying note everything else like one skill on the road and stuff is like i have it my emotions <laughs> and then i was fine um also the people i was traveling with they were like sort of a vibe john if you're watching this you're annoying <laughs> john was just being annoying being a kid his papa everywhere we were even late because of him so that was irritating so it added to my mood a little bit but at least after some time calculation that guys today was just such a successful day beautiful day um honestly even i had to speak like on behalf of my brothers and i really didn't have <laughs> a lot of words and honestly because i'm just in awe, like i was just in awe and am in awe 
of God's grace. Like, guys, my mom is so old now, which means I'm so old now. <laughs> I'm so old now, and I'm I'm like their baby. So it's just so crazy that God has just carried and continues to carry us, guys. Like all these years, like it's it's crazy. I saw my mom's cake. And that's when her age like registered. It's the same with me when I went to the pharmacy now for Easter. It was the first time I saw my age on paper since my birthday in December. And I like had a moment of shock. <laughs> I'm this old. Like why do I still feel 24? <laughs> why do I literally feel 24? It's crazy how time flies. Um, but I'm so blessed guys. We are so blessed as a family. I was telling my mom. I'm like so many kids my peers are passing away left right and center um parents are having to bury their kids if not it's the other way around a lot of kids grow up without parents or lose their parents like i feel like no matter what age you are guys losing a parent i can't imagine this life thing i don't even want to get into it because it's hectic and my heart goes out it pours out like if you're really a parent who's watching this and you lost your child like or vice versa you're you're a child who lost a parent like yo my heart goes out to you i'll never understand what you're going through but just the thought of it is like tormenting for me so i'm really blessed so my mom's birthday today was really just a moment of soaking up soaking in god's glory god's goodness because i was just in shock guys i was in shock i knew how old my mom was turning but i think once i actually saw the cake i was like yo yo like it was just yesterday when we were celebrating your other birthday so um yo uh, mom i just want to say i love you <laughs> i love you a lot uh, you know that already but Jeez, we are so blessed to have you. Um, you know what? Actually, guys, <laughs> let me cut that speech short. I'll have a little chat with my mom. But um, I'm so blessed to have that woman, man. She's strict and stuff. Um, but it's God in us here. We are the people that we all three of us are the people that we are because of the way that they raised us. Um, they really did the best that they could. And life again to him, which just when you get older, guys, like, oh, moments like this are really, really, really deep. And I'm just so filled, like, besides even today, just lately, I've been filled with a lot of gratitude. And I'm so happy to finally be at this place because it's been rough. <laughs> it's been rough, but that doesn't change God's goodness um and yeah guys i think i'm gonna end the vlog here for today it's been a very 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 long a very very long day i'm just gonna continue editing uh, guys i actually forgot to say i don't even know why i have my bonnet on and stuff is and i haven't washed my face yet but anyway I just wanted to say guys my mom is so cute like <laughs> i remember calling her yesterday and she actually wanted me to come through yesterday but it just wasn't possible so i had to come this morning and she was like no i just wanted you to to come through in time so that you can have time to vlog and all of that and i was like oh my like that was so deep for me guys guys like it's horrible but what Barona don't really understand this whole youtube social media thing so i didn't think that she gets it like that <laughs> so that was just so so sweet and so so deep for me yo to all support her parents like shout out like even if you don't know what your kid is doing shout out like just cheer them on guys i was really touched my mom was the last person i expected to like mention my youtube channel although in general she is someone that supports my moves i remember live fresh out of um high school as well um 
my parents just didn't understand my degree <laughs> they didn't understand my degree and my my choice you know um and i thank god that they live to see like the fruits of their labor and stuff but my mom was so supportive my dad was literally like on the edge he was on the fence i remember him asking my brothers oh, what is this thing you know like he was not feeling it until i was like about my first year in like deep in you know and he was like okay and then i was just blessed enough to get a job and everything so it worked out it worked out but my mom from the get-go was like baby girl anything you want to do i get it but honestly youtube i didn't think it was that deep so for her to mention it like it really makes it deep for me genuinely oh guys so i just wanted to, <laughs> to say that why did i take off my earrings now i look like a boy <laughs> But anyway, guys, good night. See you guys. And by the time you all see this, it will obviously be long up. But guys, if you haven't, please check out the video. I'm about to finish editing it right now. Please check the video where I talk about my testimony, like my journey um, of my life since I gave over my life to Christ. And, and it's been three times at this point. <laughs> please go watch that please go see what god really poured into me i tried to spend some time really seeking him on that video i'm very nervous about it i don't want to lie guys uh god is a very big deal to me i take god and his business and his kingdom very seriously so this is my first sit down video first time publicly those who know me know that i'm god fearing you know um but I think if you meet me now, like if you met me before 2022, <laughs> maybe it's a little bit more amped up right now. But um, those who know, know. So it's nothing new, but it is the first time that I just publicly speak about God. And Lekhone for me, in so much depth, you know, before this, I could never go deeper than this about God. So I'm excited to see what other videos he's gonna drop. He's gonna drop in my in my spirit in my heart because it has been quite a journey, and I know that a lot of us, many of us, are struggling with the same things. So I'm excited to see what God is going to do in that area. But other than that, guys, if you haven't already, right after this vlog, check it out. It's some life changing stuff. I was very shocked to i literally just took my notepad pen and i said god uh wilderness season <laughs> it's been rough but you're telling me to talk about it what do you want me to say and i was so surprised that so many points came out of it guys i'm telling you even right now the footage was like sitting at two hours 40 minutes i was like that's crazy <laughs> so right now it's sitting at two hours um that's still crazy <laughs> so i'm at least praying to get it to like an hour and a half which is still crazy <laughs> but it's definitely worth listening so i think maybe my sit down videos might be longer especially when it comes to faith like the thing is you cannot limit the holy spirit you can't um even editing there are some points where i feel like i could have said so much more and then there are points where literally guys the holy spirit takes over like it guys i tried filming this video at least three times and yeah the footage just didn't work out and stuff but i'm like nah it's fine whatever comes out in this video will also work out as well and if anyone has any questions anything guys please do not be afraid to holler at me especially pertaining to god i would love to just guys my mom's calling me now <laughs> sorry about that guys <laughs> i had to go i'm back all changed and stuff haven't washed my face still um but what i was basically saying was please guys don't be afraid to send me questions anything pertaining to 
faith um, I'm not saying I know everything definitely not what I'm saying <laughs> because what I'm going to do with your questions is definitely see God on them first of all I just want to say that there's not there's no such thing as a stupid question guys <laughs> when it comes to this God thing honestly personally I feel like I'm one of those people I don't believe there's such a thing as a stupid question honestly 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 more especially pertaining to faith guys and just to even make you an example <laughs> i remember when i started like reading the bible in in bits um or, or god would lead me to certain verses i started to notice that every time god would say right hand right hand and i asked him Mohore, why <laughs> why not your left hand <laughs> And can I tell you guys that he answered? <laughs> he said, guys, uh, he answered, but I'm so embarrassed to even say I can't remember what he said in detail, but something along the lines that the right hand back in the day would um, signify a king, something like that, guys. I'm too tired to really go into it, but my point with that is there is no such thing as a stupid question. I Also, I encourage you guys, to know God for yourself please guys but I know that it's not always that easy especially if you don't have a relationship with him or you're just starting out and sometimes you just need someone to help you out here and there I'm not appointing myself but I'm just saying that if you have a question and you feel like you're just too embarrassed to ask it i promise you <laughs> there's no such thing as a dumb question um and god would be more than happy to answer your silly question like how he did with my <laughs> with my right hand or <laughs> i think it's always so funny for me but yeah guys um see y'all tomorrow um i think when you guys see me tomorrow it will be on the road um today has just been eventful so i really doubt my mom and i are going to be able to do something for mother's day but i'm hoping to just maybe get a chance to get her something i did not have a chance guys today so we'll just see how that goes but yeah see y'all tomorrow bye thanks for watching i hope you guys are enjoying Guys, hi! It's Sunday today. I'm literally about to leave. This is my outfit. This is zoomed out. This is my outfit. Personally, I feel like. <laughs> what was that? What are you doing? <laughs> but personally, I feel like I'm a bit overdressed. But here it is. Here it goes, guys. Bye. Catch you in just. I'm in so much peace right now, bro.